guys, this is my first video on this channel, but let's get to the point uh, because I'm going to show you how to root any Android device that has a 5.0 or 5.1 lollipop version. Well, this is the easiest and the safest method I found on the internet. And I will put the link in the description and you need to install the zip file. Uh, it's called update super su um, and version 2.4 I think and it's in zip file so and I would recommend you to put it into your SD card as you see at the bottom and now I'm gonna reboot my device into recovery mode um, I forget to tell you that you first need to unlock your uh, bootloader. Uh, so if you if you haven't unlocked it yet, uh, watch other videos on YouTube how to unlock it. I may um, put a video in the future uh, about it. But let's get further, and I'm gonna reboot my device. So now I have rebooted my device into recovery mode. Um, yes, I have installed uh, Clockwork mode uh, recovery. So, uh, so um, now you need to go to install zip. You need to go down and click on power button. And you'll see in the second one it says choose zip from SD card. SD card one uh, storage SD card one. Sorry. Um, Choose that, and now go down until you see uh, update super su version 2.4.zip. Now this is the file you need to ch uh, you uh, check, and after you've done that, click uh, for yes, and let's do it. So now it's installing. And that was done. That was really easy, as I told you. It's, it's the easiest and the fastest way. But now, what I would recommend you is just reboot your device or uh, wipe the cache or um, wipe the Dolphin cache. If you don't know how to do it with uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery, you just go to Advanced, and then uh, you see Wipe Dolphin Cache. But I've already done that, so let's just reboot the system. Um, if it's going to ask to fix the root, I am going to warn you right now to never do this because this is going to break your device. Never do it. At, never. Just never. Don't do it. Just click on no. Let's go further. So now it's, it's, it's rebooting. Yes, I have the Samsung Galaxy Express 2. Um, just wait a little bit and... After it's done rebooting, I'll be back. So we'll just wait a couple of seconds. Now, I'm done rebooting my device. So what you need to do right now, um, as you see, um, it says that you need to update the uh, binary. Just do it. That's no problem. Click on Continue. And I have a, a, a Clockwork mod installed, so I'm going to click on CVM. And it's going to say it's going to reboot. Just click on OK. I was going to reboot again into recovery mode. And it's just going to install. Just wait a couple of minutes. It's not that long. So now it has been done. Again, it asks you to fix the root. Say no and just reboot your device. And that's it for the heart part. Um, now I'm going to show you what you need to do, um, the options you need to do for if you have a clock, uh, kind of got mod installed. Just let it reboot. After it's done, I'm going to come back. So my phone has been rebooted, and now you just need to go to... Uh, Super SU, and I think it's over here. 
just open that. And you need to go to settings and just need to go down and somewhere over here. Um, option. So something. Um, I would tell you to respect the SM root settings. Uh, check that. And there was something else, but I think it only asks it once because I have already rooted the device. Um, but it's going to do so uh, kind of go mod won't uninstall it. Um, this is it for today um, and until next Saturday. Yeah.